Peppa Pig Tails. Go long, Peppa! Today, Peppa and her playgroup are learning about American Hi, football. Hey, you. That is a very bouncy egg. <laughs> this is not an egg. This is a football. No! Footballs are round. And you don't throw them, you kick them. This is a special football from America. American footballs are egg-shaped. And you mostly throw them. <laughs> Silly egg ball. <laughs> egg ball! Egg ball! Egg ball! Egg ball! Egg ball. <laughs> Peppa and her playgroup are dressed in American football kit. You all look great in your kit. Especially you, Pedro. Every team needs a mascot. cock a doodle do. <laughs> now you're ready to play American football. Um, I mean, egg ball. Egg ball! To win points in uh, egg ball, you have to be really good at catching the ball. <laughs> Got it! Oh! Oh! <gasps> hmm. You can also get points by kicking the ball through a big goal like this one. Ooh! Pepper. Would you like to kick the ball into the goal? Kicking? Like normal football. I'm good at that. <laughs> I don't think egg ball is as fun as normal football. Susie, would you like a turn? <laughs> has caught the ball, so she gets a point. I did it! Now for the best part of American football. I mean, egg ball. <laughs> After you score a point, you do a dance. Peppa and her friends love egg ball. Everyone loves egg ball. Egg ball! Egg ball! Egg ball! Pig Tails! <sighs> Pepper's family are having a New Year's Eve party and all the guests are arriving. Hello, Pepper. Are you excited to stay up until midnight? I'm going to have a nap, so I'm really awake for the fireworks. <sighs> Looks like George needs a nap, too. Would you like a nap, Peppa? No, Mummy. We're big, so we're going to stay up until midnight. Let's go and play in my room. <laughs> What's that sound? Wake up, Peppa. You fell asleep. No, I didn't. I'm big, so I don't need a nap. How are we going to stay awake? Uh... Oh, let's make each other jump. Then we'll be really awake. Let's try it. <laughs> 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 I know what will keep us awake. Hide and seek. I'll be it. <laughs> One, two, three. Here I come. Oh, 
有方去。<笑><笑>
went really fast. Don't worry. This is why it's very important to stop, look, listen and always wait for the green man before crossing the road. The green man! Remember what we learned, children? Stop, look and listen. All clear, no cars. Let's go. It's safe to cross now. Peppa and her playgroup are learning about road safety today. Hello, Daddy. Hello, Peppa. Peppa's playgroup. Hello, Daddy Pig. Oh, green light. Well, see you later, Peppa. Thank you for helping us, Police Officer Panda. All in a day's work. Pepper is helping Police Officer Panda make sure everyone follows road safety rules. No, no, no. Emily, you need to stay on your side of the road. Sorry, Pepper, My wheel is stuck. We'll come help you. Wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo. <laughs> <laughs> We're keeping the road safe for cars and people. <gasps> Pedro hasn't noticed that Green Man has turned to red. Pedro, the red man means don't walk. <laughs> Thanks, Peppa. All in a day's work. <gasps> Wait a minute. Freddy is dressed as a robber. We have to catch the robber. Wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo. Oh, the red light means stop. There he goes. Now we've got him. Freddy, are you dressed as a robber because you are a robber? No, I just like stripes. Oh. So you're not a robber? Nope. Oh. Well, you can go then, but not so fast. OK. Bye, Pepper. Ooh! Great work, Officer Pepper. Everyone is remembering to stop, look and listen and only walk when they see... The Green Man! That means we can go. All in a day's work, Officer Panda. Peppa loves keeping everyone safe, and everyone <laughs> loves feeling safe. Peppa Pig Tales Found one! That's a big one. Granny Pig has asked Pepper and George to find some fruit and vegetables for lunch. First on the list is a fruit that can be red or green. What do you think that can be? Hmm. <laughs> George, we don't have time to eat. We have to find fruit for lunch. <gasps> An apple. They can be red or green. Next, we have to find a long vegetable that is orange and crunchy. I know. Rebecca Rabbit always brings carrots to playgroup. They are long and orange and crunchy. Grandpa, where are the carrot trees? <laughs> Not everything grows on trees. Some vegetables grow in the ground. <laughs> I'll help you, George. <laughs> <laughs> Next up is a vegetable that looks like... Small trees. <laughs> I can only see big trees, Grandpa. Not small ones. These stools look like little trees. They're broccoli. Ho, 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 ho. Very good, Pepper. 
Last on the list is oranges. That's odd. I don't think I grow any oranges. If there are oranges here, George and I will find them, Grandpa. Pepper and George are searching everywhere for an orange. Uh. <laughs> orange! That is the right colour, but not what we are looking for. Oranges are round. But they can't seem to find one anywhere. We found the orange! <laughs> that is the right colour, and it is round, <gasps> but that is a pumpkin. Oh. oh. <gasps> oranges. oranges! Where did you find those oranges, Granny? We looked everywhere. From the supermarket, of course. <laughs> 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 it's Valentine's Day. Peppa and George are making a special dinner Whoops. for Mummy and Daddy Pig. Grandpa Pig is helping. My goodness! We're making special Valentine's Day pizzas, Granny Pig. Because Valentine's Day is all about showing others that you love them. I know! We can make the pizzas heart-shaped! <laughs> now, we toss the dough up into the air, just like they do in Roma. That's a place in Italy, you know. <laughs> Aha! Hmm. <laughs> Whoops! Just like in Roma. Uh oh. <laughs> oh. We can cover the lumpy bits with some vegetables <gasps> from the garden. Oh. Mummy and Daddy Pig are not sure what's going on. Peppa and George are collecting vegetables. The pizzas are going to have lots of toppings. <laughs> <laughs> Let's take the vegetables inside. Pepper and George <laughs> add vegetables to their pizza. I know how to make the pizzas even more special. We can add Mummy and Daddy Pig's favourite foods. Good idea, Pepper. What are their favourite foods? <laughs> <laughs> Spaghetti and chocolate cake. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! We should make the pizzas look like Mummy and Daddy. Peppa and George make faces with the pizza toppings. <laughs> now they're really special. Oh, George. <laughs> <gasps> Here are your extra special Valentine's Day pizzas. <sighs> Chocolate cake? My favourite! <laughs> dinosaur! A spaghetti dinosaur! Thank you, Pepper and George. <laughs> they look too good to eat. Mummy and Daddy Pig think their Valentine pizzas are very special indeed. Pepper Pig Tales. <gasps> that car went really fast. Don't worry, this is why it's very important to stop. Look, listen, and always wait for the green man before crossing the road. The green man! Remember what we learned, children? Stop, look, and listen. All clear, no cars. 
Let's go. It's safe to cross now. Peppa and her playgroup are learning about road safety today. Hello, Daddy. Hello, Peppa. Peppa's playgroup. Hello, Daddy Pig. Oh, green light. Well, see you later, Peppa. Thank you for helping us, Police Officer Panda. All in a day's work. Peppa is helping Police Officer Panda make sure everyone follows road safety rules. No, no, no. Emily, you need to stay on your side of the road. Sorry, Peppa. My wheel is stuck. We'll come help you. Wee-oo, wee-oo, wee-oo. <laughs> We're keeping the road safe for cars and people. <gasps> Pedro hasn't noticed that Green Man has turned to red. Pedro, the red man means don't walk. <laughs> Thanks, Peppa. All in a day's work. <gasps> Wait a minute, Freddy is dressed as a robber. We have to catch the robber. Wee-oo, wee-oo, wee-oo. Oh, the red light means stop. There he goes. Now we've got him. Freddy, are you dressed as a robber because you are a robber? No. I just like stripes. Oh. So you're not a robber? Nope. Oh. Well, you can go then, but not so fast. OK. Bye, Peppa. Ooh. Great work, Officer Peppa. Everyone is remembering to stop, look and listen and only walk when they see... The Green Man! That means we can go! All in a day's work, Officer Panda. Peppa loves keeping everyone safe, and everyone <laughs> loves feeling safe. <laughs> is Whoa. very excited to play in the snow today. Yay! Let's go! But Candy Ooh. doesn't look very happy. Meow! Ooh, it's so cold! <laughs> snow is always cold. That's part of the fun. I didn't think it'd be this cold. Can we play inside in the warm? Oh, but I want to play in the snow. Peppa and Candy mm. don't know what to do. I know! Why don't we do one snow game and one inside game? And we see which is best. OK! That sounds like a good idea. Peppa and Candy are making a snowman. <laughs> it's very tall. That was fun. Hmm. Just need a nice woolly hat. <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> I think we should go inside and get warm now. Mm. Peppa and Candy have made a <laughs> pillow fort. It is very cosy and warm. There! All finished! It's perfect! This was a fun idea. Phew! It's very warm in here. Why don't we try something in the snow to cool down? Peppa and Candy spend the day playing lots of different games. <laughs> they go sledding outside. Whee! <gasps> oh. <gasps> they drink delicious hot chocolate. <sighs> and make lovely snow angels. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> They even race around indoors. <laughs> and outdoors. But they can't agree what is best. We've 
tried everything. Hello, Peppa. Hello, Candy. Why the sad faces? We can't find something to do that is fun in the warm and in the cold. That is difficult. Oh, how about some delicious fruity snow cones? Mm. They're made of nice cold snow yeah. and perfect to be enjoyed in the warm inside. Mmm, thank you, Miss Rabbit. Wow, thank you. Peppa and Candy both agree that this is best. <laughs> Peppa Pig Tales Peppa and Rebecca Rabbit are making a pillow fort today. Careful, don't fall on the fort. Almost got it. Whoa. Squeak. We did it. Now we need to decorate the inside. <sighs> hmm. Something else is missing. Oh! Something to eat! <laughs> Mummy! What a beautiful pillow fort! Can we have something to eat, please? Of course! I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Let's pretend the pillow fort is really big inside. <laughs> wow! <laughs> Catch, Peppa! <laughs> Let's pretend the floor is really bouncy, like a trampoline. Squeak! <laughs> it's so bouncy! <laughs> oh no! The ball bounced over there. Let's bounce after it. Uh. This floor is green, so let's pretend it's squelchy! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> but the ball isn't here, maybe over there. <laughs> <laughs> this room is blue, so let's pretend it's cold! <laughs> There's the ball! Hooray! L let's get out of here. Um, which way did we c come in? Peppa, where are you? We're lost in the pillow fort. I'll come get you. No, Mummy. The fort isn't built for grown-ups. <gasps> oh, I can fit through anything. <sighs> <gasps> Mummy Pig is stuck. Oh. Uh, uh. Mummy, your wiggles are breaking the fall. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> For you. Oh. All that pretending has made me even more hungry. Good thing I brought you some food. Now, we just need to find it under these pillows. <laughs> Peppa Pig Tails! Whoops! <gasps> Peppa and her friends are going to watch the football match today. Oh dear! The cake is squashed. Oh no! My trophy cake! I'm very sorry, Mummy Pig. It's okay. We'll just have to make a new one. But there's only ten minutes until the match starts. Well, we'd better get a wriggle on then. To the supermarket! All right. Who wants to play football? Yes! Yay! We've not got much time, so we're going to have to split up. Peppa, you and I will find the sponge cakes. Hooray! 
Hey. Granny Pig, you and Mandy Mouse find the icing. And Daddy Pig, you and George are in charge of sprinkles. Sprinkles! Let's go. Let's go. Aim for the top corner. There, in the top corner. <laughs> Put it in the back of the net. Well done. Pop it in the basket. Hooray! I can save three shots at once. Ha! Ah. We'll need three sponge cakes, Pepper. Whoa! Phew! Well done, team. We've got all the ingredients. Now let's get back home and make this cake. Everyone is very busy making the new cake. Yeah! <laughs> How many goals is that? One hundred or one hundred and one? We made a new cake! Hooray! And just in time, the game's about to start! Peppa Pig Tails! Pepper and Susie Sheep have decided to wear their clothes backwards today. Oh! <laughs> Goodbye, Susie! Goodbye, Pepper! Oh! Hmm. Pepper, Susie, why are you wearing your clothes backwards? <laughs> oh. <laughs> and why are you walking backwards? Because today is Backwards Day! You say and do everything backwards! <laughs> no, we don't! <laughs> <laughs> well, have fun! <laughs> we won't! <laughs> Peppa and Susie Sheep are chasing each other around the garden backwards. <laughs> You're it! Try to catch me! <laughs> it's very difficult to play games backwards. Where did you go, Susie? Ooh. Coming! <laughs> oh. I know! Let's play backwards in the park! <laughs> <laughs> Mr Bull is very confused to see Pepper and oh. Susie Sheep skipping backwards. Good morning! Why are you going backwards? It's backwards day! We have to do everything backwards! Is it backwards day already? <laughs> I'd better get my backwards drills ready! <laughs> oh. Whoa! Whoa! Oh. Whoops! Sorry! Pepper and Susie Sheep spend backwards day playing in the park. Backward swinging feels the same as forward. But not all the games are as fun backwards. This is backwards. No, this is backwards. Let's play backwards frisbee. Catch. <laughs> Who would like an ice cream? Yay! Oops, we mean no. I see you're having a fun backwards day. Ah. <laughs> I'm going to eat my ice cream backwards. Oops. <laughs> Upside down isn't quite the same as backwards. It's all very confusing. I think backwards day might 
be over now. Peppa and Susie <laughs> Sheep enjoyed Backwards Day, but they're very glad that things aren't backwards anymore. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her family have been shopping at the supermarket. <laughs> Goodbye, supermarket. Supermarket! <laughs> Is that a robot? <laughs> no, Peppa. It's a vending machine. You put money in to buy the food and drinks inside. Can we buy something from the robot, please? <laughs> OK. We can each choose one thing as a special treat. Yay! Peppa is very excited to buy something from the robot vending machine. Here you go, Peppa. <laughs> Goodbye, coin. Now, press the button that matches the thing you would like. I would like an orange juice. There it is! Hooray! Delicious! <laughs> dinosaur! George has found a biscuit shaped like a dinosaur. Here you go, George. <laughs> now, press the button with the dinosaur. <laughs> dinosaur! <gasps> <laughs> I think I will have, hmm, that drink. Oh dear, it's stuck. Daddy Pig's drink is stuck on a sandwich. The sandwich is in the way. Naughty sandwich. We'll need to buy the sandwich as well, so the drink will fall down with it. <laughs> Oh, it's stuck again. Naughty pineapple. Ah, oh, let's buy that too. It's stuck again, again. <laughs> <laughs> The drink has finally fallen all the way down to the bottom. Goody! Yay! I can finally have my drink. <gasps> oh no! My drink has turned into fizz. Poor Daddy. Why don't you choose something else from the vending machine? Good idea. Oh, the vending machine is empty. That's because we bought everything! <laughs> Peppa Pig Tails! <laughs> boing! 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 Emily Elephant is bouncing on a space hopper. Why are you bouncing in the sandpit, Emily? It's my New Year's resolution! What is that? It's a challenge you have to do for the whole year! Mine's bouncing! Boing! Boing! I want a New Year resolution too! Peppa and her friends are going to make their own New Year's resolutions. I'm going to score a gazillion goals. <laughs> One, two. I'm going to talk in gobbledygook. Bingly bangly bibbly bobbly wibbly wobbly. <laughs> I'm going to be a tiger. Rawr! 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 Hmm. I think my New Year's resolution. Will be to jump in muddy puddles. I just have to find some first. Uh, six, uh, one, nine, 
nine. Uh, four. Danny Dog is muddling his numbers and getting very tired. Nine, 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 nine. Roar! <gasps> Candy Cat's roars have given Emily Elephant a fright. Emily Elephant has lost her space hopper. Where are you, Muddy Puddles? Peppa can't find any muddy puddles. Um, oh, hmm. Can you see any muddy puddles, Susie? No, I can't. Um, I mean, muddily, muddily, puddily, puddily. Rawr! Everyone is Rawr! finding their Rawr! New Year's resolutions Bear. quite hard. <laughs> what are you all doing? <laughs> We're doing our New Year's reservations. Uh, Eleven to twelve. Mine is jumping in muddy puddles, but I can't find any. Ho, ho, ho. New Year's resolutions aren't about doing these sorts of challenges. Aren't they? No. They're about choosing nice things to do in the next year. Things like helping with the washing up. Or tidying your room. <laughs> oh. Phew! That sounds much easier than scoring a gazillion goals. Speak for yourself. One hundred and one. <laughs> <laughs> Peppa Pig Tails. It's time to get ready for playgroup, Peppa. Ho, ho, ho. Oh, hello, Santa. Back already? Today is Peppa's first day back at playgroup after the Christmas holidays. No, Mummy, it's me. But Peppa <laughs> is not ready for Christmas to be over. <laughs> oh, Peppa, that's a wonderful outfit, but I don't think it's right for playgroup. But I like dressing up as Santa. I don't want Christmas to be over. It's so much fun. I know. But playgroup can be lots of fun too. You'd better go and pack your backpack. Good morning, Pepper. That's a very full backpack you've got there. <coughs> And quite heavy, too. <sighs> Phew, what have you got in there? Just some tinsel to make the playgroup sparkly. I see. A toy I got from Santa. Oh, my. Some candy cane. Delicious. Oh, and some Brussels sprouts. Hmm. Maybe you should take some things that are a bit more useful for playgroup. Like what? Maybe some crayons for colouring in, some yummy fruit, and a book to read. Oh, Santa brought me that book. That's a good idea. <laughs> Time to go, Peppa. <laughs> Oh, can we ride the sled to playgroup? I love going fast. Whee! <laughs> I don't think so, Peppa. There isn't any snow. Even the snowman is almost gone. I think we'll have to take the car today, Peppa. Oh, OK. I know you're sad Christmas is over, but I promise Playgroup can be just as fun. Everyone at Playgroup is very happy to see Peppa this morning. Welcome back, Peppa. Did you have a fun Christmas break? I... <laughs> Hi, Peppa. Do you want to play dress-up with me? Oh, yes. I love dressing up. <laughs> or we could read a book. I got a new book from Santa. <gasps> Let's race each other on our scooters. 
Oh, yes, please. <gasps> Playgroup is just as fun as Christmas. <laughs> Peppa really loves Christmas, but she also loves going back to Playgroup. Everyone loves going back to Playgroup. Peppa Pig Tales. Peppa and her family are taking baby Alexander on the Ferris wheel, but he isn't very happy. What's that smell? <laughs> yeah! Hmm, it's baby Alexander. He needs a nappy change. But we're at the front of the queue for the Ferris wheel. Ooh. Hold your noses, everyone. Boo! This Ferris wheel smells terrible. Sorry, Peppa, but it's our job to look after baby Alexander. If we help now, we can play later. Yes, baby Alexander needs our help. That's the spirit. Now let's go and look for a nappy changing station. Oh, that's better. Not here. <coughs> oh. <laughs> Not here. <laughs> Done, Peppa. We found the nappy changing station. First, we have to take off the dirty nappy and put it in the bin. Um, where is the bin? Hmm. Ooh. Here it is, Daddy. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Now we must wash our hands. Add a dab of cream. Whoa! Oh. <laughs> Whoops! Sorry, Peppa. Now, finally, a clean nappy. Can I do this bit, Daddy? Of course, Peppa. There. All better. That was so fun. I've never changed a nappy before. You did very well, Peppa. But do you know what's even more fun than changing a nappy? Pedro Pony, Candy Cat, Mandy Mouse, Gerald Giraffe and Danny Dog are playing football. Look, Mommy, my friends are playing football. Hello, Peppa. Do you want to play with us? Yes, please. Whoever scores the best goal wins the trophy. Ooh. Peppa loves shiny trophies. Do you want to join our team, Peppa? No, thank you. I will play on my own. I don't think you should play on your own, Peppa. But then I can win the trophy all for myself. Peppa is going to play all on her own against everyone else. Ah. Oh, dear. Good try, Peppa. Have another go. Hmm. Maybe I need to kick it harder. <gasps> um, almost. 
Here you go, Peppa. Maybe if I use my other foot. Whoa! Oof. You have to score with the ball, not your shoe. Squeak! Hmm. This is too hard. Why don't you have a go in goal? Good idea, Mummy. I'll be a great goalie. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Goal! Mummy, why can they score a goal but I can't? Because, Peppa, football is all about teamwork. And you can't work as a team if you don't have a team in the first place. <laughs> um, can I join your team, please? Of course you can. We've got a spare shirt just for you. Woof, woof. Hooray! But who will play in goal? I will. Just you try and get past me. You scored the goal, Pedro, so you get the trophy. But we all scored the goal together, Peppa. As a team. That's right. You all win the trophy. <coughs> Hooray! <laughs> Peppa Pig Tails. <laughs> 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 Pedro Pony, Candy Cat, Mandy Mouse, Gerald Giraffe and Danny Dog are playing football. Look, Mummy, my friends are playing football. Hello, Peppa. Do you want to play with us? Yes, please. <coughs> Whoever scores the best goal wins the trophy. Ooh. Peppa loves shiny trophies. Do you want to join our team, Peppa? No, thank you. I will play on my own. I don't think you should play on your own, Peppa. But then I can win the trophy all for myself. Peppa is going to play all on her own against everyone else. Uh, oh, dear. Good try, Peppa. Have another go. Hmm. Maybe I need to kick it harder. <gasps> um, almost. Here you go, Peppa. Maybe if I use my other foot. Whoa! Oof. You have to score with the ball, not your shoe. Squeak! Hmm, this is too hard. Why don't you have a go in goal? Good idea, Mummy. I'll be a great goalie. Goal! Mummy, why can they score a goal but I can't? Because, Peppa, football is all about teamwork. And you can't work as a team if you don't have a team in the first place. <laughs> um, can I join your team, please? Of course you can. We've got a spare shirt just for you. Woof, woof. Hooray! But who will play in goal? I will. Just you try and get past me. <laughs> <laughs> you scored the goal, Pedro, so you get the trophy. But we all scored the goal together, Peppa. As 
as a team. That's right. You all win the trophy. <laughs> Hooray! <laughs> Peppa Pig Tails. Well, hey! Today is Valentine's Day. <laughs> Daddy Pig loves Valentine's Day. Splendid! We need lots of decorations for Mummy Pig's big surprise. What big surprise? We're going to make a special Valentine's Day surprise for when Mummy Pig comes home. <laughs> Better get cracking. Hooray! Peppa and George are having fun making Valentine's Day decorations. And Daddy Pig is having fun hanging the decorations. Ha -ha! But Daddy Pig is not being careful. <laughs> and ta-da! Perfect. Now, what's next? Hmm. <gasps> Perhaps we should tidy up. Ooh, let's make Valentine's pancakes first. <laughs> ah! Peppa, George and Daddy Pig are making yummy heart-shaped pancakes. Ha! <laughs> now for the fun bit, whisking. This is fun. <laughs> Peppa loves whisking. <laughs> Peppa really loves whisking. Oh my! Careful! If you make too much mess, we won't have enough mix to make... Valentine's pancakes. Aha! <laughs> Wonderful. Now we'd better get tidying. But what about a Valentine's card, Daddy? Oh, yes. Daddy Pig isn't sure whether to make the card or tidy up the mess. Quickly now. Peppa and George are helping Daddy Pig make a Valentine's card. But Mummy Pig is almost home. <laughs> and done. Now, just enough time to tidy up before... <laughs> What's going on in here? Happy Valentine's, Valentine's Day. Day! We made you a card. And pancakes. What a lovely surprise. Thank you, everyone. <laughs> Things got a bit messy as we worked, but as a last Valentine's surprise, we'll get tidying up, won't we? <laughs> Mummy Pig loves her Valentine surprise, and Pepper, George and Daddy Pig loved making it and cleaning up after it. <laughs> Peppa Pig Tails! <laughs> Handball! That's against the rules! Oops! Why are you blowing a whistle, Miss Rabbit? And what do those cards mean? I'm the referee. I blow the whistle to get attention. If someone makes a mistake, I give them a yellow card. And if someone's being a bit silly, I give them a red card. Ooh, can I be the referee? Of course. Now, Pepper is the referee. Ha-ha! <laughs> uh, <laughs> 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 <gasps> <gasps> What's wrong, Peppa? You kicked the ball too fast. Mandy missed it. But that's not against the rules. I'm the referee now, Daddy, so I say it is. Oh, dear. Peppa likes being the referee, and she really likes blowing the whistle. <laughs> Your shoelace is undone. <gasps> You're not smiling. Oh. You nearly kicked that lovely flower. 
Pepper is finding all sorts of reasons to blow the whistle. Oh! <gasps> You're running too fast! <laughs> Whee! <laughs> You're swinging too high! Oh! Woof, woof. Your ice cream is too melty! Watch out! Oof! Can we have a go now? I want a kick! Uh, oh. Oh. <laughs> Daddy Pig and Miss Rabbit are not following the rules. <gasps> Referee! This duck is too sweet! Referee Pepper! <laughs> Peppa is having so much fun, she's Ooh. forgotten all about the football match. Oops. Uh -huh. uh. <gasps> oh. Daddy, that's not how you play football. You're being a bit silly. I'm going to have to give you a red card. <laughs> Sorry, Peppa. I suppose we got a bit carried away. That's OK, Daddy. But I think it's your turn to referee now. <laughs> Peppa Pig Tails. Stop! Ooh. Today. Peppa and her family are walking to the duck pond. But there's a big metal barrier in the way. Sorry, folks. The path is closed. But we're almost at the pond. Uh. I'm afraid it's much too slippy. Whoa! Just follow the diversion signs with the bright red arrows. Won't take you long. A diversion is when you have to go a different way. Come on, everyone. <laughs> It'll be an adventure. See you soon, ducks. <laughs> Here it is. Oh. Peppa has found the first bright red arrow. <gasps> and another. <laughs> and another. <gasps> hmm. <Ooh. gasps> but the next sign has fallen down. Wakey, wakey, Mr. Sign. Ooh. Nobody knows which way to go. Hmm. Do we go left or right? The right way sounds right. <laughs> <laughs> Hooray! <laughs> uh, are we lost? We're not lost. We just don't know where we are. When you don't know where you are, you are probably lost. Uh, um. Look, oh. a duck. Hello, duck. <laughs> Excuse me, Mrs. Duck. Do you know where the duck pond is? What a spot of luck! Lead the way, duck. This is a duck trail, Daddy. We must all waddle like ducks. We're going to the duck pond, big wiggle whack. We're going to see the ducks go quack, quack, quack. We're, We're going, going to, to the duck pond, big wiggle whack. We're, We're going, going to see the ducks go quack, quack, quack. Peppa and her family have made it to the duck pond. We did it! Yay! You took your time! I bet you're glad you took the diversion. Yes. It was much more fun. Whoa! <laughs> and much less slippery. Peppa Pig Tails! <gasps> Peppa 
Peppa and Emily Elephant are having lots of fun at the beach today. They love the water. <laughs> Look, Emily, I'm a fish. <gasps> blob, blob, blob. <laughs> I have an idea. <gasps> Peppa, <gasps> how did you do that, Emily? Did you hold your breath? <laughs> no. I can use my trunk to breathe because it's so long. Oh. <gasps> What's the matter, Peppa? I wish I had a trunk like Emily. So I could breathe underwater and look at the fish. I know. Come with me, Peppa. <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> this long tube goes in your mouth and means you can breathe underwater. Like Emily's trunk. <laughs> <laughs> exactly like Emily's trunk. <laughs> Why does your voice sound funny, Peppa? It's my snorkel. It means I can breathe underwater like you. Look! <gasps> no, Peppa! Yuck! Oh, Peppa, you must be careful. <sighs> the snorkel didn't work. And the water tasted horrible. That's because it's salt water, Peppa. You need to keep your lips shut tight around the snorkel so you can breathe through your mouth without letting water in. You have to take long, deep breaths like this. <sighs> Pepper practices taking big, deep breaths. <sighs> Do you want to try again? Um, OK. I did it! I saw lots of colourful fish! Yes, well done! And thank you for helping her, Emily. <laughs> and to get rid of the taste of the salty water, George and I thought you might like some... Ice cream! Pepper Pig Tails. Baby Alexander and his family have come to say Happy Christmas. But Baby Alexander isn't happy at all. Why is Baby Alexander crying? Christmas is fun. Well, this is Baby Alexander's first Christmas. He doesn't know how fun it can be yet. Then it's got to be extra special. I'll show him all my favourite Christmassy things. I love Christmas dinner. It has carrot, potato, sprouts. <laughs> no, you're supposed to eat it, not throw it. Let's try something else. Wrapping presents is really fun. You can put the bow on top. <laughs> no, we need to wrap them up so other people can open them. Alexander thinks unwrapping presents is much more fun than wrapping them. Hmm. I don't think Alexander likes Christmas at all. Really? He's been having fun with you all day. But I wanted it to be extra special for him. 
Spending Christmas with his cousin is extra special, Peppa. But he's doing it all wrong. Alexander is just a baby. Maybe you need to find some simple things he can do right. Christmas for babies. Oh, I have some ideas. <laughs> Baby Alexander enjoys passing out the Christmas presents. <laughs> Thank you, Alexander. This one's for Mummy. And he really likes Christmas crafts. <laughs> well done, Alexander. And music. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride on a one-horse open sleigh. Hooray! But he enjoys spending Christmas with Pepper most of all. Now we'll always remember Alexander's first Christmas. Pig Tails! Today is Sports Day at Peppa's Playgroup. There is a pink team and a blue team. They're trying to win gold medals. I'm going to win! Oh, uh, whoops! Rebecca Rabbit is finding the sack race quite difficult. Yay! Hooray! Emily Elephant on the pink team has won the sack race. Hooray! You're so fast! Squeak! Oh no! I lost! You did your best! And we can still win! Oh. Now it is time for the egg and spoon race. Faster, Peppa! Squeak! But Peppa is finding it difficult to run fast and balance her egg. Slower, Peppa! Don't drop the egg! OK. <laughs> Slow down, Danny. But don't go too slow. Slower. Faster. Slower. No faster. Yeah. Squeak. <laughs> no! <gasps> Phew! <laughs> we did it! We won the race! It's a draw between the two teams. The next game is ring toss. Whichever team hooks the most rings onto the wooden stick will win sports day. That's one point for each team. <laughs> Another point for each team. It's still a draw. Rebecca and Freddy, it's your turn. But if I miss... We'll lose. Oh, don't worry about winning. Just do your best. And have lots of fun. <coughs> yeah! <coughs> we lost. Squeak. But we had a lot of fun anyway. You're right, Peppa. Well done, Pink Team. You get gold medals. Yeah. <laughs> and the Blue Team did really well, too. So they get silver medals. Whoa! Yay! The Pink Team and the Blue Team love Sports Day. Everyone loves Sports Day. Peppa Pig Tails! <laughs> splash, splash, 
<laughs> Dinosaur! Today, Peppa and George are helping to make <laughs> Christmas lunch. They are giving the vegetables a bath. Quack! Quack! <laughs> yes! They need bath toys. There you go, vegetables. <laughs> That's not quite what I meant when I said wash the vegetables. I finished cooking the potatoes. Why don't you and George mash them? Yes, yes. Potatoes! <laughs> not with your hands, with these. <laughs> OK, Daddy. Now, what's next, Mummy Pig? Done. That was quick. Ho, ho, ho. You've made an igloo out of potato. What fun. You can help me ice the cake now. Yes, please. With a few bits of green icing and some splodges of white icing, it looks like mistletoe. Mistletoe! Hooray! Our turn, our turn. Here you go, Peppa. You do the leaves and, George, you do the... Ooh. <laughs> like this? Well, not quite, but this is much more fun than mistletoe. It looks like a snowman. Snowman! <laughs> Granny and Grandpa Pig are arriving for Christmas lunch. Happy Christmas, ev Oh, oh my. Pepper and George's Christmas lunch looks messier than Grandma Pig expected. Peppa and George have been helping us make the Christmas lunch. It's not how we'd normally do it. No, but it's much more fun. Peppa and her family enjoy a lovely Christmas lunch together. <laughs> oh. <laughs> It's filled with lots of laughter. And some fun new traditions, too. <laughs> Happy Christmas, everyone. Happy Christmas! and her playgroup are playing lots of games today. <laughs> <laughs> it feels like jelly. Correct. Hmm. Aha! Feels like a banana. Correct again. <laughs> <gasps> oh! Mm. Tastes like banana too. <laughs> 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 Your go, Pedro. But I don't want to touch something smushy. It'll be okay. Our smushy things were delicious. Oh, it's cold and made of metal. Is it a key? It is. Well done, Pedro. Hooray! It's a key to a special mystery box. You need to find two more to unlock the prize. Ooh! How do we find more, Madam Gazelle? In our next game, of course. These are piñatas. You have to find the exciting surprises inside. How do we do that? You break them open with these soft foam bats. <coughs> Full of snow. <laughs> Mine too. <gasps> ah! Oh, oh. Hooray! <laughs> I did it. The second key. Only one. 
one more to go. I love Parser Parcel. Me too. Me three. Oh. <laughs> oh, I thought I won. This is a very long song. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? Oh, the music stopped. <laughs> Hooray! Now Peppa and her friends have found all three keys, it's time to find out their prize. <laughs> wow! Christmas biscuits! <gasps> Yum! You did it, Peppa! You all did it together, Pedro. Pig Tails! Snap! Oh! Peppa is playing games with her friends. I love playing Snap! I keep winning! I don't like Snap. Peppa would quite like to win a game. Snap! I know! Let's play Snakes and Ladders instead! Woohoo! Snakes and ladders. But I was winning. <laughs> One, two, three, four. I'm going to win. Two places. Now I get to go up a ladder. I'm right near the finish line. Now it's your turn, Rebecca. Yeah. <gasps> oh dear, Rebecca isn't going to win if she goes down the snake I know, let's play Marble Run I love Marble Run Marble Run! But I was going to win <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Yay! My pink marble is winning! I know! Let's play Pack the Parrot! Ooh! I love Pack the Parrot! But my marble is winning! It's going to pop up! I can't look! I know! Let's play Snap again! <laughs> Snap! Snakes and ladders! Peppa and her friends like swapping games. In fact, they like swapping games so much, they've forgotten who is winning. be time for a new game called Tidying Up. <laughs> Peppa Pig Tales It is Christmas Eve and Daddy Pig is putting the Christmas tree on the car so it can be decorated at home. Peppa is helping. You, Peppa. <laughs> oh, <laughs> ah, we've got all the new decorations. Daddy, perfect. Now let's head home. <laughs> 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 
Hooray! <laughs> Everyone is very excited to decorate the tree. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a wonderful sleigh. Hey! <gasps> Why have we stopped, Daddy? I'm not sure we're going to fit in the tunnel with this tree. Let's try going slowly. Snowing! Oh no! Bits of the tree are falling off. Oh, we'll have to go the long way round. <laughs> wish you a Merry Christmas! We wish you a Merry Christmas! We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year! <laughs> the trees on the road are brushing against the tree on our car. Oh, no! Maybe this road with no trees will be better. This road has no trees, so the wind is blowing the Christmas tree. All the pines must have fallen off on the way. But we need a tree for Christmas. Bertie! <gasps> George has given Pepper an idea. We can still decorate the tree and make it really fun and Christmassy. That's a wonderful idea, Pepper. Pepper and her family get to work decorating their new special kind of Christmas tree. Looks lovely. This bird thinks the Christmas tree looks lovely too. Birdie! <laughs> Wonderful, Pepper. Now the birds can have Christmas too. The birds love their new Christmas tree. Everybody loves the new Christmas tree. Ho, ho, ho. Peppa Pig Tails! <laughs> Peppa is having lots of fun playing in the snow with her friends. <laughs> That's cold! But every game they play seems to cover them in cold snow. <laughs> Hello, Daddy! Pepper, you're covered in snow. I think it's time to come inside and warm up, or you'll turn into a snow monster. <laughs> snow monsters don't exist, Daddy. Can we play for five <gasps> more minutes? Please? Oh, all right then. Five more minutes. Yay! <laughs> 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 oh dear. Peppa and her friends play lots of games in the snow. They aren't worried about turning into snow monsters at all. Let's play snowballs! Yay! <laughs> 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 what was that noise? It sounded like... Has anybody seen my glasses? A, A snow, snow monster! monster. <laughs> Quick, let's hide. Oh dear. Let's hide here. Phew! The snow monster won't find us here. <gasps> The snow monster has found them. Peppa, it's me! <laughs> oh, that's not a snow monster. <laughs> it's Daddy Pig! <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
I told you there's no such thing as snow monsters. Come on, Daddy. We'll make you warm again and melt all this snow. And look for my glasses on the way. Oh. Your glasses! Hooray! Thank you, Susie. Daddy Pig is very glad to be back home oh. in the world. He's not a snow monster anymore. <laughs> Everyone is warming up inside with hot chocolate. Ah. Oh, even snow monsters like hot chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> Brother George, this is Mummy Pig, and this is Daddy Pig. <laughs> Peppa Pig. Valentine's Day. It is morning. Peppa and her family are having breakfast. Do you know what today is, Peppa? Is it my birthday? No. Is it your birthday? No, it's Valentine's Day. What's that? On Valentine's Day, you tell the people you love that you love them. Usually with a special card, like this. Happy Valentine's Day, Mummy Pig. Oh, thank you, Daddy Pig. Roses are red, violets are blue, you are so lovely and I love you. Hugs and kisses, Snufflekins. Oh, I love you too, Daddy Pig. Oh, oh. Mummy, do you have a card for Daddy? Oh, I gave it to Mr Zebra the Postman. You gave a Valentine's card to Mr Zebra the Postman? Yes, he'll deliver it with the post today. Oh, I see. It is time for playgroup. Mr Bull is cleaning the windows. <laughs> Good morning, children. Good morning, Madame Gazelle. Does anybody know what today is? It's window cleaning day. Apart from it being window cleaning day? It's Valentine's Day. Very good, Pepper. It is the day to give cards to the people we love. My daddy didn't get one this morning. What? Oh, how sad. I've finished cleaning the windows, Madam Gazelle. Thank you, Mr Bull. Oh, dear. You look sad. Oh, I just heard that Daddy Pig did not get a Valentine card. No Valentine's card? No. Goodbye, Mr Bull. Goodbye. Children, today we will all make Valentine's cards for the people we love. Yay! I'm going to make a Valentine's card for my mummy and daddy. I'm making a Valentine's card for my mummy and daddy. <laughs> I'm making a Valentine's card for Super Potato. And one for my mummy and daddy. <laughs> Mr Bull has gone to the supermarket. Hello, Mr Bull. You look sad. Well... I heard this morning that Daddy Pig didn't get a Valentine's card. No. Really? Did you hear that, Dr Hamster? Daddy Pig didn't get a Valentine's card. Ah, oh, poor Pickle. Did you hear? Daddy Pig did not get a Valentine's card. Oh, dear. What was that? Nobody's ever given Daddy Pig a Valentine's card. <gasps> <laughs> Finish, Madame Gazelle! What wonderful cards, children! I am sure whoever gets them will be very happy. <laughs> it is home time. <laughs> mummy, Mummy! We made Valentine's cards for you and Daddy! Oh, lovely! Pepper and George have arrived home. <laughs> happy Valentine's Day, Daddy! For me? Yes! Valentine! <laughs> Fantastic! Did you get a card for Mummy yet? No, not yet. Ah, Mr Zebra, busy day? A very busy day indeed. Look at this sack 
full of Valentine's cards. Have you got a card for me? No, I haven't got a card for you. Oh. I've got a whole sack full. Ooh. There are hundreds of Valentine's cards, <laughs> all for Daddy Pig. Hooray! Daddy Pig, who sent you all these Valentine's cards? Oh, it wasn't you. No, I sent you this one. With love from Mummy Pig. Who sent all the rest? Um. Happy Valentine's Day, Daddy Pig! Everyone has sent Daddy Pig a Valentine's card. Oh, oh, thank you. <laughs> Pepper, George and Mummy Pig love Daddy Pig. Everyone loves Daddy Pig. <laughs> Brother George, this is Mummy Pig, and this is Daddy Pig. <laughs> Peppa Pig. The perfect day. Peppa and her family are going to a shopping centre today. That's a big shop. It's not one shop, Peppa. It's lots of shops all under the same roof. Wow! But we're not shopping today. Not shopping at the shops? No. Mummy's here for a perfect day experience. Ooh! This is Miss Rabbit's spa. Hello, Mummy Pig. Are you ready for your perfect day experience? Yes, I think so. But what exactly is it? Oh, lots of lovely things. You can have a massage. <clears throat> have your fingernails painted. Or have a herbal face wash. Oh, that all sounds lovely. Do we have to do it too, Daddy? No, Peppa. We can go and find our own perfect day. Oh, goody. Bye, Mummy. See you later. Where are we going to find our perfect day, Daddy? Hmm, I don't know. It's just shops and shops and... Ooh, magic moving stairs. That, Pepper, is an escalator. Can we go on it? Yes. Hold my hand. <laughs> <laughs> Here is Susie Sheep. <gasps> it's Susie! Hello! Hello, Peppa. Where are you going? We're going to the top. Where are you going? We're going to the bottom. <laughs> Peppa has reached the top. Quick, Daddy. I need to go down to find Susie. I'm coming to find you, Peppa. I'm coming to find you, Susie. Ah, you're, you're going, going the wrong, wrong way. Peppa and George are back at the bottom. But Susie is at the top. I think that's enough escalators for now. But I need to see Susie. Then we can use the lift. Ooh. I need to find Peppa. Then let's take the lift. It's not working. Someone else is using it. We just have to wait. But I need to find... <laughs> Peppa and Susie are best friends. Papa, look what I've got. <laughs> Little Susie's in boxes. How did you do that? In the photo booth. I'll show you. This is the photo booth. You sit in here, put the money in there, and then it flashes. It's not flashing. I think it's broken. Oh, I missed it. <laughs> There's more. Smile. When does it flash? Ah, oh, I missed it again. <laughs> you a funny face. <laughs> <laughs> and the last one. Has it finished yet? <laughs> I think I might be in that one. <laughs> Here are the pictures. Look at all of those funny faces. 
<laughs> again, again! I think it's time we pick up Mummy Pig. Mummy, did you have a perfect day? Yes, thank you. I did, Peppa. Did you? Yes. We went up and down the magic stairs and we saw Susie and did some funny pictures. That does sound nice. Home time! Daddy Pig, did you have a perfect day? My perfect day starts when we get home. Daddy, what's your perfect day? <laughs> Come and see! <laughs> Whee! Daddy Pig is jumping up and down in muddy puddles. Everyone is jumping up and down in muddy puddles. It's the perfect end to a perfect day! <laughs> Peppa Pig Peppa Pig Peppa Pig This is my little brother George. This is Mummy Pig. And this is Daddy Pig. <laughs> Peppa Pig. <laughs> Breakfast Club. Peppa and her friends are going to play group earlier than usual this morning. Good morning, children. Good morning, Madam Gazelle. Who knows why we have come to play group early today? Because we didn't learn enough things yesterday. No, Danny, that is not the reason. Is it because you like us so much? Well, I do like you all, but it is not the reason. Is it a very special day today? Yes, Pedro. We have all come to play group early because today is Breakfast Club. Ooh. And who knows what we do at Breakfast Club? Eat our breakfast. Correct. I love eating breakfast. So do I. Me too. Everyone <laughs> loves eating breakfast. And why is it so important to have a good breakfast? Because breakfast wakes your mouth up. So we can do lots of talking. Talk, 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 talk. Yes, yes. Thank you, Peppa. <laughs> I eat breakfast because it tastes nice. Yes, Pedro. And breakfast gives us energy to use throughout the day. Uh... What is energy? Energy is the strength and vitality required for physical or mental activity. That's right, Edmund. <laughs> <laughs> so, Rebecca, what do you use your energy for? I use it for hopping. <laughs> Very good. I use energy for thinking. What's he doing? Edmund is thinking. Yes, I was thinking. Edmund Elephant is a clever clogs. <laughs> it can take a lot of energy to think. Ooh. And now we will all choose what to have for breakfast. We have bread, cheese, jam, porridge, yogurt. May I have carrots for my breakfast, please? Yes, you may. Can I have cereal, please? Of course you can. <laughs> Madam Gazelle? Can I have toast, please? Yes, Susie. I shall make you some toast. Does anyone else want toast? No, thank you. OK. The bread goes in here, and we push this lever down. The toaster gets very hot, so please do not touch it. And wait for it. It's coming any minute. Hopla! Cut it! Wow! Can I have toast, please? I'm I'm me, I'm me. I'm me. Everybody wants toast for breakfast. Well, in that case, I will have to use the big toaster. Ooh. It's a super toaster. <laughs> <laughs> Plates ready, everyone. Wait for it. Here it comes. Whee! <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> Everyone has caught their toast. Again, again! No, children. Eat the toast you have first. <laughs> <laughs> Can I have honey on my toast, please? Can I have marmalade, please? Of course, children. I'm having strawberry jam on mine. I'm having honey, marmalade and strawberry jam on my toast. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting lots of energy in my tummy. So am I. I'm getting strawberry jam energy. I'm getting honey jam and marmalade energy. Everyone has <laughs> lots and lots of energy. And now it is time for us to do... A breakfast bounce. Follow me. <laughs> Use the energy from the food to get our bodies and minds ready for the day. Copy me, children. Egg, apple, yogurt, pancake and toast. Which one for breakfast do I like the most? Toast, honey, egg, yum. Toast, toast, toast. Breakfast is over and everyone is ready to start the day. Peppa Pig. Peppa Pig. Peppa Pig. Brother George. This is Mummy Pig. And this is Daddy Pig. <laughs> Peppa Pig. Botanical Gardens. Today, Peppa and George are going to the Botanical Gardens. Miss Rabbit is head gardener. Welcome to the Botanical Gardens, where we grow plants from all around the world. Ooh. Ooh. Our first garden is a wild flower meadow. It will look nice when you've tidied it up a bit. This is what wild flower meadows are meant to look like, Daddy Pig. Ah! It takes a lot of effort to make it look this messy. The butterflies and bees like it. That's right. Wild flower meadows are very good for butterflies and bees. <laughs> Would you like to see the other gardens? Yes, yes please. please. This is the hot house. It's very hot in here. Yes, Peppa. It is where we grow plants that come from very hot places. We have cacti, Ooh. palm trees, ah. and this is a Venus flytrap. Why is it called a flytrap? Because it traps flies. Watch. The Venus flytrap has caught a fly. <laughs> George, let's play Venus fly traps. <laughs> I will be the fly trap and you can be the fly. Buzz, buzz, buzz. Caught you, George. <laughs> now I'll be the fly and you be the fly trap. Buzz. <laughs> George, <laughs> Venus fly traps do not run. <laughs> oh dear. George is a very sad Venus flytrap. Sorry, George. Let's both be flies. Calm down, little flies. It's too hot to buzz about in here. Don't worry. The next room is much cooler. This is our cold house. Is it the North Pole Garden? Sort of. The proper name is Arctic Tundra Garden. Ice cream. Does ice cream grow at the North Pole, Miss Rabbit? No. Our fridge is broken, so we're keeping them here to stop them melting. Would you like one? Yes, please. Thank you. Pepper and George love ice cream, even in the cold. <laughs> <laughs> Follow me. This is the rainforest garden. Wow! wow. Miss Rabbit? Why is it called a rainforest? We call it the rainforest because it's a forest. And it rains a lot. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I make it rain every hour on the hour. It's nice. The rain in the rainforest is lovely and warm. A room where it rains when you want. We need something like this at home. We've got one, Daddy Pig. 
It's called a shower. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> and through here is Mr Rabbit. Mr Rabbit is in the experiment room. Hello, everyone. My job is to make new plants. How? Well, butterflies and bees do it by taking pollen from one flower to another. The flowers then make seeds that grow into new plants. Mmm, this flower smells lovely. Oh, this pretty flower doesn't smell of anything. When I put the pollen from one onto the other, the seeds made a new flower that smells lovely and looks pretty. Mmm, that does smell lovely. You can do it with vegetables as well. I put this small, tasty carrot together with this big, not very tasty carrot. And made a big, tasty carrot. Uh, no, actually. I made a small, not very tasty carrot. Oh. oh. Would you like to see the children's garden now? Yes, please. <laughs> it has a very special water feature. A fountain? No. A waterfall? No. A great big muddy puddle. <laughs> wow. Come on, George. Whee! Peppa loves all the botanical gardens, especially the muddy one. Peppa Pig. <laughs> Peppa Pig. <laughs> Peppa Pig. <laughs> This is my little brother George. This is Mummy Pig. And this is Daddy Pig. <laughs> Peppa Pig. Mr. Potato's Fruit and Vegetable Quiz. Fruit and vegetables keep us alive. Always remember to eat your five. It is good to eat five fruit and vegetables every day. Children? Mr. Potato has come to find out how much we all know about fruit and vegetables. We know everything about fruit and vegetables. And I know everything about carrots. Good, because today we are going to have a fruit and vegetable quiz. Ooh! What is a quiz? A quiz is where I ask you a question, and if you know the answer, you press the buzzer. <laughs> Ah! We will need two teams. Peppa, Rebecca and Pedro will be on one team. Susie, Danny and Mandy will be on the other team. <laughs> Let's begin. Our first question is, which of these is not a vegetable? Lettuce, radish, celery or a car? <laughs> A car is not a vegetable. That is right. Hooray! Next question. A chocolate biscuit is a fruit. Yes or no? Yes, it's a fruit. My daddy eats five chocolate biscuits every day. Have another guess, Pedro. Is a chocolate biscuit a fruit? Uh, no. That's right. Hooray! And now, the fruit or vegetable questions. Fruit or vegetable? I hope he asks about carrots. What is a strawberry? Fruit or vegetable? A strawberry is a fruit. Yes! A watermelon. Fruit or vegetable? A watermelon is a fruit. Yes. A cabbage, fruit or vegetable? A cabbage is a vegetable. Yes. A tomato, fruit or vegetable? Vegetable. Fruit. A tomato is a vegetable, not a fruit. No. A tomato is a fruit, not a vegetable. Would you like to call a friend? Yes, please. Call a friend. 
Tell me, which of your friends might know the answer? Edmund Elephant. Then let's telephone Edmund the Elephant. Hooray! It's for you. Hello. Hello, Edmund. Is a tomato a fruit or a vegetable? Some people think a tomato is a fruit because it has seeds. But in the 19th century, the Port Authority of New York classified tomatoes as vegetables, which were subject to a 10% import tax. So I will say you are both right. Hooray! Well done, Edmund the Elephant. Are you ready for the last question of the quiz? Yes! I hope it's a question about carrots. Rebecca, you always talk about carrots. I like carrots. <laughs> Name that vegetable. Name that vegetable. I will describe a vegetable and you will tell me what it is. I am orange and I grow in the ground. What am I? Uh... Rebecca, what's your favourite vegetable? A carrot? That's right! A carrot! Hooray! <laughs> Both teams win the fruit and vegetable quiz! We win! Hooray! <laughs> Everybody wins with fruit and vegetables. <laughs> Vegetables keep us alive. Eat them, move as part of your five. Wiggle your hips and do a jive. Always remember to eat your five. Brother George. This is Mummy Pig. And this is Daddy Pig. <laughs> Peppa Pig. Viking Day. Peppa and George are spending the day with Granny and Grandpa Pig. Grandpa Pig. Granny Pig. Hello. Hello, Mum. Historical reenactment day, is it? Yes. Today I am a Viking. Ooh. What's that? Vikings were people who lived a very long time ago. They had helmets and shields and ran around shouting, <laughs> Can we be Vikings too, Granny? Of course. Here are some helmets. <laughs> I'm a Viking. <laughs> Roar! Vicky, Vicky, roar! <laughs> Pepper and George love being Vikings. See you later. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Pepper and George, come and see what I've made for Viking Day. Granny Pig has made a great big dragon's head. Ooh. It's to go on the front of our Viking boat. Viking boat? Yes. Today we're going sailing with the other grannies. Ho oh, ho! It's just an excuse to have tea and cake. It's not just tea and cake. We also have sandwiches and an apple. Here are the other Viking grannies. Hello, Hello Granny Pig. Pig! Are you all ready for Viking Day? Yes, and these little Vikings are coming too. Hooray! Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> Madam Gazelle, why hasn't your helmet got horns on? In actual fact, Pepper, Vikings had helmets without horns. Like this. See? No horns. <laughs> but you have got horns. Have I? Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye, Grandpa Pig. Goodbye. Have fun on your Viking boat. Are we going on a real Viking boat, Granny? Not a real Viking boat. We will be using Grandpa Pig's boat instead. I'm sure he won't mind. Here is Grandpa Pig's boat. All aboard, Vikings! Lower the sail. Fix on the dragon head. And you two need real Viking life jackets. <laughs> <laughs> Are we all ready? Roar! Then let's go! Oh, how do we start the boat? I'll phone Grandpa Pig. 
Grandpa Pig speaking. Hello, Grandpa. <coughs> How did you start your boat? Just press the green button and off you go. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Mm -hmm. They're taking my boat. Ah! My boat! Vikings, onward! Rah! Oh, dear. The picnic basket has been left behind. <sighs> my boat! Ah! Grandad Dog, follow that boat. Aye, aye, Grandpa Pig. <laughs> Vikings, 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 we sail across the sea. We like to shout, we like to sing, we like a cup of tea. Ah! <laughs> All this sea air is making me hungry. Hungry! Hungry! Oh, where is the picnic basket? <gasps> We've forgotten the food. But I'm so hungry. And me, and me. Food, food, food. 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 The Vikings are very hungry. We need to find food. Look, what's that? It is Miss Rabbit's food stall. Food! Food! Ah! 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 Vikings! Four teas, two juices and cake, please. Oh, OK. Ah! There they are! Oh, caught you, Granny Pig. Grandpa Pig. You've arrived just in time. Have I? Yes, for tea and cake. Tea and cake. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> Vikings love tea and cake. Everybody loves tea and cake. Vikings, 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 we sail across the sea. We like to shout, we like to sing, we like a cup of tea. Rawr! <laughs> Rawr!